So how about those New Orleans Saints? Yeah, they're gonna go really far this year. <laughs> I guess. Man, what a fucking bummer. Did Drew Brees retire officially? Yeah. Not yet, but pretty sure he's going to. Actually, I think I saw some headline about them, like something about the salary cap or some shit. So maybe, uh, maybe they're trying to keep him on for another year. I think there should be an age cap for those guys too. Probably, yeah. If they take the wrong tackle and like their spines become dust. Yeah, it's like a. There's only so much CTE that a 40 year old can sustain. I would imagine. <laughs> and like I'm speaking as someone who like who's always rooting for the defense to like break Brady's and E's <laughs> yeah. on any given play. That'd be nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Something for the fans. And, and that's fan service in my opinion. Right on. <laughs> yeah, anyone who's playing Brady should just lead with the head like the olden <laughs> days. That's a big target. Yeah. Alright, let me switch to the, the game screen. Uh, okay, I got the... I'll just do the post. Gotcha. It's so stupid. It's fine. Shit. Um, could, couldn't do any photoshops of Alf this time. Just... It's alright, I feel like the, the one that you did is gonna tide us over for a while. Didn't really feel like doing with the whole left part of my body. Um, oh yeah, is that feeling any better? Oh uh, yeah, it's way better today. Good. All right, hello everybody. I'm Eric Kerr, and welcome to our still unnamed stream officially. Yeah, the stream is sponsored by Index Corporation, copyright 2013, <laughs> produced by Atlas. <laughs> I remember my encounters with Index Corporation. Man, what a... Could you have, like, a more soulless name for your fucking... Your company? <laughs> Index Corporation? Right, let me actually load my save state. Also, you gotta load uh, Discord as well. Oh, right. Uh, let's see... Okay, there we go. Yeah, I do want to work streaming knowledge in there somehow. Alright, let me load. Oh god, we're in Mikado with the... The bagpipes. Alright, let me... Let me hit up the club. This is the new terminal. What do you... Activate. Is that where the weekend is right now? In the club? <laughs> I guess so. Uh, what should we do, Master? He must just be inhaling COVID over there. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much of it, it's like forming a slime on the wall. <laughs> yeah. Oh. The most shocking part of the Super Bowl halftime show though was when they they revealed that Yoda is real. And <laughs> Get this, <laughs> he smokes weed. He was there with you. He by a huge cloud. <laughs> he came out of a huge fucking green vapor. He was there with uh, it, the force ghost of Mac Miller. <laughs> <laughs> he learned the secret from Qui-Gon Jinn. Yeah, I was gonna ask, like, in the Clone Wars show... Do they establish that Qui-Gon Jinn basically invented turning into a, a forest ghost? Uh, they get into it, but he did not invent it. Oh, okay. So, like, did he... Did he innovate on it at all? Or was it just, like, something that was lost for a while? He he essentially learned it by going to the Carl Jung planet. <laughs> I'm not, okay. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. That's That's pretty good. I don't really need any more, like, explanation. Okay. 
I was thinking, if he just, like, invented that, <laughs> what, does he just, like, show up to Yoda, and he's like, man, you gotta try this shit next time you die. <laughs> yeah, because, like, like, there's a memory going into episode two, like, it's like, well, I mean, Qui-Gon Jinn's gonna come back as a force ghost in this one, right? Yeah. You know, that was the precedent set by VOT, but no. But instead, Rogue, uh, Yoda just tells Obi-Wan, Revenge of the Sith, like, oh, by the way, here's a very important ability that I haven't told you. <laughs> That's right. Jeez. Um. It's just, there's nothing better than Star Wars. I mean, cradling your newborn son in your arms for the first time is is markedly worse <laughs> than the, the Dexter Jetser uh, scene from <laughs> Attack of the Clones. <laughs> Coruscant's favorite 50 Steiner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck, that scene is... Ugh. It's so good. And, like... He, he himself, Dexter Jester, is slovenly, but... He's like, like it's terrible <laughs> Greek stereotype. It's just... Mm -hmm. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, like... Even he himself... Like, the animation quality by now also looks like that too, so it's kind of fitting. It does, it looks... It looks alarming when you watch it now. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're heading to Shinjuku, which I think we have to like find the guide up north here. This is it, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'll let you cross the river. In the oh wait, it's Yuri Lowenthal. You wanna head over that way? Oh great. It'll cost you. Uh mm. Yeah, I guess I'll uh, pay you. Why are we going to Shinjuku again? I can't remember. <laughs> Thanks for uh chasing the black samurai, I guess. I don't really know oh, if you okay. actually have like a, a set destination at this point. Mm. Yeah, this is it. Just go west from here. I don't want to go in this domain, because that's the one with the, like, the level 24 uh, yeah, you tree. Don't to there yet. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh, fuck. We have... Yeah, we have Bufu. Do we have Bufu? We have we Bu got the Bufu. Bufu of these nuts. Alright. It's more like we got, we got Buku Buku. Yeah. Oh, we got Augie too. I'm trying to remember how we had Augie. all this set up. Augie is named after the Hindu god of fire, Agni. Did you know that? No way. Yeah, I don't really believe that either. I mean, it makes more sense than like most of the other ones, I think, but. Oh fuck, they got <laughs> they got John Zhao. Damn, Jeff Hostis. <laughs> Why the fuck does he have Hama? He must have gone to Sunday school. Yeah, he definitely. He's been reading the scriptures. Right, let's revive this piece of shit, I guess. And back in there. Mm. Yeah, like the Michael Keaton, Jack Frost versus Pazuzu. <laughs> yes. That'll do it. Like uh, yeah. Is this swamp? We gotta get an accident somehow, too. Oh, does this like actually poison me? Yeah, it does. Oh. Yeah, it does. Fuck. <laughs> Did we actually. No, we're good. We just took some damage. Twenty-three, damn. It doesn't matter, like this is like the first part of the game where you'll get a really big boost in levels. Yeah. You wanna start negotiating with some uh some Jack Frost is. Um Well, 
like Night Stalker's a foul too, right? Yeah, he is. Uh, but you do, yeah, your level's not high enough. Yeah, we don't have Demon Lingual, Lingual, Demo Lingual, whatever the fuck it's called. Yeah. I see an opening. You certainly did, Java. Was a good boy. Um. What is this? Oh, uh, it's. Are those both domains? Or was that something else? Yeah. Oh. The one below you, I think, is where you fought in the. Or is that one? Where you fight Earl Koenig? Yeah, I couldn't remember which Genie. was which. And he has, like, one of the. One of the three treasures, yeah. Yeah, the three treasures. Uh, oh, here it is. Like, Flair, do you mean, like, a Pazuzu quest involving, like, an exorcist reference? It is surprising that he really... We haven't gotten any big Pazuzu shit, like, since Megami Tensei 2. Well, by the time SMT5 comes out, it'll be the 50th anniversary of The Exorcist, so... God damn. Oh, look, it's, uh, it's the best character. Oh, boy. <laughs> what hoy, hoy, do hoy. You want? I haven't seen you before. Where are you from? So, are you guys those... <laughs> I guess she doesn't care. If people are gossiping about us in this foreign land, our infamy is indeed spreading. You are correct. We are, in fact, those same angels. Neat! <laughs> that having been established, who are you? Have you some business with us? I'm Hikaru. And I'm interested in you all. I don't know if I actually listened to her dialogue before. <laughs> <laughs> really? You just skipped through it? Yeah. I don't blame you. the black samurai huh i don't know where she is but i do know a place where there's a lot of books great truly boy tell us uh if, if you please man walter what a bookworm he's laying he on the... that about his character <laughs> he really lays on the hoys too <gasps> the jiraku bookstore in the city called ikebukuro <laughs> this seems like important evidence i'll make a note of it in the quest no it would be funny if she was just like, yeah, there's just like a book on, like, uh, a couple blocks from here. The book on or is it book off? Why are you showing us such kindness when we've only just uh, met? book off. Okay. Book on was the, the fake version of it in Persona 3, I yeah, think. Yeah, book on is a, like, it's, it's, it's the chef kiss, chef's kiss, so. <laughs> Yeah. Didn't I tell you that already? Mm -hmm. I'm interested in you guys. Well, see you later. Also, yeah. Also, no one I meet will actually remember I exist. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, calling her Hikaru was just <laughs> like too much of a dead giveaway. Mm. Did you what? know that Lucifer's You're name means so light bearer? Nah. Clearly, she's the type to win men's favor. For myself, I cannot abide her like. There, there, Isabel. Pe she knew about the book aspect. People's of names Has define. Has traveled so far already? their personalities pretty much that's why every uh <laughs> every like i don't know i forgot where i was I going with that but erica means eternal king and like i'm gonna live forever and also rule somewhere you know yeah exactly you got a down at birth <laughs> oh man <clears throat> Let's go down. Is this just straight? Yeah, that's just the underground. Yep. Oh, look at this conspicuous NPC. Can I talk to him? Huh? What's that? It just looks like a Lupin. Really does. I don't know, man. I can't hear you with this. 
extremely thick accent that you're speaking <laughs> with. <laughs> hey, man. Listen to my local dialect. <laughs> He's using contractions and shit. This is crazy. <laughs> Oh, look at the, listen to this music with like the slowdown every time the, the quest menu opens up. It's sick. Ooh. Turns into like a trance song. Can we get a good look at his face? Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Oh, man. Honestly, his face looks like that of Iron Man from the s and It does, yeah. Trailer. You can see his nose to the side, though. It's not bad, man. Yeah. Oh, good over I here. Think relative to the platform, um, I really like this game's graphics. Yeah, it looks great. All the environmental art design is really strong still. Do I have anything worth selling? I'll probably get rid of these bomb of horizons at some point. Yeah, if you need money, just sell shit. Yeah, that's always the way I did it. Just immediately Plus unload get... all my valuable shit. Plus the limits are pretty strict, so you might as well make money. Yeah, that's true. Where's the Hunter's Association? Oh. Hey, can I share something with you? It's a combat Depends training class that makes use of virtual reality functions. If you want, I can explain oh, it to you in detail. I totally forgot about the virtual battle shit. I don't want to hear the details. I'll do it okay, <laughs> off screen probably. There's really not that much point to doing them. Not really, I don't remember the rewards it's, being particularly good. It's getting mock high, I think. Did you get all that? I mean, I like it conceptually, though. I think puzzle battles and RPGs yeah. are really cool. If you've got business, yeah, they're neat. Hurry up and spit it out. Let's talk to... Good music, too. Oh yeah, they have, like, the remix. That's... Kagome Tower. Money, She'll go though. too soon, I guess. We'll be there for like 10 minutes tops. <laughs> it's literally two rooms. Yeah. To their credit, it is structured like a tower. It's just like two staircases. Yeah. And it looks cool. It does have a really strong aesthetic and like a nice theme too, it's just such a waste. Mm. Do I have... no, I don't have anything. Then again, if they had expanded upon it in 4A, it would have been like two hours long. That's true, yeah, it would have been way too much. And then you still fight Asmodeus at the end, so it would kind of suck. <laughs> His art is updated. <laughs> He's got a big ass chair now. <laughs> <laughs> Just like an easy boy recliner though. Yeah. <laughs> it has like a foam dragon's head on it. Yeah. Pro but probably not even that. <laughs> I don't know about Asmodeus. He gives off like the energy of a guy who like drives a big pickup truck and then attaches the the truck nuts on he's got big truck nuts <laughs> energy yep hey. pierced truck nuts Ugh. I mean, that's like keys all over too yeah nice just big motif nice pair of fuzzy Rings dice of keys yeah So our next battle, um, event battle against Osei. Is that the uh, the guy who's guarding the terminal? Let me, let me see. 
Yeah, it might be. Um, it sounds familiar. You bet of. You bet of. Oh. Oh, they actually have to accept the quest. Why am I letting this Vin Diesel type man handle me? Are all the Ashrakai from like Osaka? I guess so. Do they have the Kansai man? <laughs> oh, I have to actually look at the bulletin board? Oh man. Oh wait, it's over here. Yeah, quests are handled pretty clumsily in this game. Seriously. Alright, skins is number two. Dirty Joe is number nine. I don't think I've done more than like one quest so far, so it's uh it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. But it doesn't really matter. R twenty fifth Yeah. That's true. R twenty fifth. The fuck that is. Aru. You've got business, then hurry up and spit it out. Yeah, Walter's really dragging his Aru ass here. Go see each other alive again. Um, oh, let me check out the weapon shop too. Oh, oh I don't need swords. What am I what am I doing? You still got You still got the cash. Actually, we're not going to get anything better than the, the Black Samurai armor for a while, are we? Mm. Paltry increases to HP. I don't need that. You still got business? Maybe an accessory, though. A decent amount of MP. How much do we have? Um, look at your current... Oh no, shit's slowing down now. What'd you want to do? I was trying to like, check it against my current equipment. I'll just get the fancy earring. Oh god, we have to get out of the shop before it crashes. <laughs> Make sure you bring more oh boy. You have the, the Bruce gun. Alright, we're good. Yeah, I actually accept it. I forgot they actually use the rankings in the the neutral side quest thing. What a fucking what a pain in the ass. Oh god, it's happening again. Corpse disposal. Yes. Jesus Christ. You might as well go off the corpses first and do the save later. I think so? Is he that much harder? Um, he has... He has 900, uh, 897 HP. Corpses have 750 each. Or 650 each. Is those say weak to anything? Uh, no. Mm -mm. Oh, fuck it then. It's not difficult, but... Yeah, it's funny how, like, you see the rankings, and they're just totally random the whole game, and then somehow they actually matter. <laughs> yeah. In neutral. Pretty silly. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot of great anime grunts. Sounds like all the, like the extras in Godzilla movies. <laughs> huh? Whoa? Who? Uh -huh. Oh! <laughs> oh, that shit. And 
Yeah, this quest was famously the uh, the demo they used in the uh, on site uh, SMT4 events. I guess it's decently demonstrative of the game structure. Mm -hmm. Like when I went went to try it myself, um, first thing I wanted to do was try and fuse to see if there were any uh, unknown demons in the game, as of then unknown. Oh right, yeah. But I, I didn't figure it out quite fast enough, unfortunately. Man. Uh. Oh, I guess we only have one guy with Augie, huh? That's a waste of MP. Well, they don't like respawn, I don't think. Mm -mm. Uh, you have Pele, and she should have Augie. Oh, that's right. Get her in there. Oh, now she attacks last. Oh, fuck. Well, I'll just use... Um... Oh, that did it. Yeah, you can use lightning or uh, force. You give a shitload of XP though, damn. Good luck with the rest of them. Who's got healing? It's slowing down again? No. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh my god. I should probably install that <laughs> that update that the emulator keeps asking me to to do. No one here. It's a nice empty room. I forget if that's the only one in this area, but you do have to eventually go into, uh, uh, where is it, like, the Kabukicho area? Something like that, yeah. Uh, maybe I want to recruit Jack Frost. He's 15, right? Yeah. Alright, let's try to... Oh, don't use Zom. Oh, thank god, I block it. We're good. <laughs> what is with this little asshole? No. God damn it. No. You'll get the quests another way, another way and he'll, uh... They do walk away when they give you the quest, right? Yeah. Got plenty of life stones. Let me try to cheat this guy out of a, a chakra drop. Ooh. Sure. Oh my god, he's so needy. It actually worked, damn. Whoa, what is that voice sample? <laughs> Alright, sweet. Let's see if we can fuse it with <laughs> Shan Zhao or Pele. <clears throat> Gotta remember how to use the, uh, totally intuitive, simple fusion <laughs> menu. Yeah, it's great when you want to fuse two specific demons. Oh, we can make, uh... That's not too bad. Make, yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, see what Sean J I'll confuse with. Yeah, let me, let me see if, uh... Doesn't look like they have a fusion option. Hmm. Make Moshavu. Oh, we'd have to fuse. No, I'm not fusion my MVP into this fucking thing. <laughs> Ozmi is the best uh, fusion from there. Yeah. I think I'll just go with the. Uh, Ictaniki. Ictaniki? Yeah. Got choices. Agi. Oof. Uh, nope. 
Do I need another Zon? I don't think so. I really know how it's good. Alright. Did you do Pele? Yeah. Alright, sweet. All right. It's loud. Yeah. You... It's like a spider it's trickster, spider. right? Yeah. Let's see how they describe him in the, the compendium. Yeah, they don't mention his spider form, which is not surprising. There could be multiple descriptions out there. That's true. It happens. He's got one of those very broad designs to where, like, you could just name him after any Native American hero figure, and it would probably work. <laughs> right, yeah. Check this out. Do you know what prompted uh, George Lucas to announce that Jedi aren't celibate? They just uh, are forbidden from like forming attachments. Uh, I have no idea. I hope it was probably because like just that assumption and the way Anakin and Padme's relationship is handled in the prequels. Yeah. Like, no, you can never have sex at all. It's really funny. So you can fuck, but you can't like have attachments. Which means, so I think there's like Jedi run brothel. <laughs> yeah, <and stuff. laughs> they just do it. They're just fucking like completely dead eyed. Yeah, Kiati Mundi is just in like a a perpetual state <laughs> of post nut clarity. Uh, probably weak to Zio. Ah. Well, like even uh. Obi Wan does have some kind of quasi relationship as well. Let me find out. Really? Is that like in the Clone yeah. Wars show? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Oh, no, don't. Oh, fuck. This always bites me in the ass whenever I. <laughs> I never know how to cancel it correctly. Against gun. That makes sense. I'm not gonna waste MP on that. What? Fuck this. Smirk. Oh my god, they killed me. They are working me over pretty bad right now. Jesus Christ. Alright, that did it. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, don't... Uh, auto battle is not worth it. Yeah. At this point. God damn it. Should have bought more revival beads, though. Yeah, it is just so easy to get buried as soon as they start smirking. Did you watch any of the uh, kitten bowl today? Oh, no, I didn't catch any. Is it still going on? <laughs> oh, no, it was over hours ago. Shit. Good. Working the kittens for eight hours. I don't think so. <laughs> I can do it. They have a lot of energy. Mm -hmm. No, like, I missed the beginning when I turned it on. It was this segment about this cat named Ares. Oh, fuck. And, uh, spelled R A R I E S, like the zodiac. Oh, yeah. But then they say, like, the owner named her after the Greek god of war. I was like, no. <laughs> that's not how it's that's No, man. God, the kitten bull announces are a bunch of. Fucking Neanderthals, apparently. <laughs> All right. I, I don't oh, no, know. Like that was the end. They gave her a social media account, and it was indeed A R I E S. That might have, that might have been it. Yeah. Uh, oh, are they both stunned? Oh my fucking god! Another one of these. 
Jeez. Yeah, Binding Claw works really well against you. Oh, guy. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. What's that? Forty-one percent chance of escape. Obarion. Ice. All right. Perfect. Dirty Joe, you dirty piece of shit. God, lay off of him for like a second. So what are you trying to do here? You trying to? I'm trying to find the other corpses because they said that like yeah, I think six. They're in a left. different area. But... Yeah, that that, um, <laughs> that makes more sense. But go, go back underground and get healed. Yeah, definitely. Because we are. Already out of MP. Are we saving her for something right now? We have 36, damn. Uh, we want uh, the demon skill slots now, right? Skill uh, augment. Skill augment. Where is it? Oh, it's 60, Jesus. How much are the demon skill slots? Let's see, uh, 30. 30. <laughs> That's worth it, to be honest. Yeah, I'll get it. What should we do, Master? Ooh, fuck, Burrows. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds so good. What should we do, Master? Burrows, you are not invited to my Super Bowl after party. No Tostitos for you. Are they not gonna let me go down there? Yeah, I'm scared. Yes. Oh, I have to abandon it. Do I really have to redo? Like all that shit? All you have to redo is you might have to fight one more corpse. I think so, yeah. Same one you already beat. It's no big deal. What's your pleasure? It does give a shitload of MP. I mean, uh, XP. What? Mm. <laughs> oh? You can't fail quests, so it's no big deal. Some of that. If you've got business, what? But no, I don't want to heal again. I would like some sprite in my gauntlet, though. Maybe some Mountain Dew. Yeah. If you've got business, <laughs> what is what is the functional difference between sprite and Mountain Dew? I don't think I've had a Mountain Dew in like 15 uh, years. Sprite is just lime and lime, supposedly, and Mountain Dew is just. Just sugar flavor. Really? really? That's it? Uh, <laughs> I guess they're both just green. Green sugar. Well, Sprite's not a green. Just the packaging is green. Yeah, I mean the packaging. Yeah, well, one's made by Coke, Sprite, and the other one's made by Pepsi. Oh, yeah. yeah. We'll take on Osei? Yeah, might as well. Get that quick save. Yeah, let's go ahead. Hey, kiddo, you shouldn't be in here. Yeah, I bet Hope's a real annoying motherfucker. Like outside the context of uh, of just giving us missions. Can't you tell by looking around? This is a domain. We keep guys who get too yeah, when he away. actually shows a personality off screen. Wait, you, you're, you're that kid. Oh, this is gonna be a mess. How is this guy host like? I've got a job to do. He's wearing like a like a jacket over a hoodie. <laughs> Might as well take you with me and force you into my crew. The time has come to show you what a man your senior can do. Must have been a really cool club. Fucking weird. Numbers aren't everything in a fight. A showy horde doesn't always get the job done. All right, there's Ose and Ose's cock and balls. This guy. I think I'm better off. <laughs> so, second hottest so humanoid feline <laughs> after <laughs> Tony the Tiger. Yeah. <laughs> You're screwed for sure this time. Yeah, go after Jonathan. Keep going. Yeah, good guy. Nice. Does Ose MVP. like uh, nullify anything? Nope. All Just right. darkness. Alright, we'll go ham on him then. 
Uh, he uses Hasahaba. Fuck, that's so gonna suck. Maybe some defense. Yeah. Skip that. <laughs> that's funny. Let's see. Let's see. Fatal sword. <laughs> yeah, it really is like that. Pretty much any. Use a use a rocket kaja or two. Yeah, that's a good idea. Um. Sure. Yeah, they have real like. I got paid enough to go get a subway sub energy. They're getting paid scale for sure. Like every. GRPG voice actor. <laughs> this is going okay. Oh fuck, he's blight. Any crit? Why did I say that? Oh, he got. He got Dirty Joe. I know if we can come back from that. Pretty much fucked, unless he's he's not even close to being dead. Ugh. God damn it. Oh yeah, but it's not house hopper. It's, the Japanese is uh Benon Zappa. That's what it's called? Whatever the hell that is. Huh. Yep. Benon Zappa. Well, what would that save state? Cause I wanna pay that asshole. <laughs> All right, let's shore up our defense a little bit more this time. Hey. Hey. This guy just sounds like Reno from Final Fantasy Seven. Seven? Yeah, Seven. I almost said Final Fantasy Seventeen for some reason. <laughs> it just feels like that. Yeah, they'll bring him back. Now what a G! Just going for the. The guest member every time. Yeah, sure. It's two, three. Fuck, don't use blight already. Oh man. Alright, no one's dead at least. Um. Yeah, just skip him. <clears throat> I'll play it safe. But if he gets like a single crit, then we're just screwed. Uh, this should work. Yeah. Thought we had Tarun do, but I guess not. Yeah, keep doing that shit. This animation on those say he's like only Skip his turn. Yeah, he's in, he's like only animated from the top up. I guess he didn't want to do anything with his uh his cod piece. Yeah. It's like Morax's animation. <laughs> yeah. He's just like one pixel difference that bobs up and down. Alright, you got this. Don't do it on Dirty Joe. Oh, fuck. Smirk. Oh, at least he didn't smirk. Yeah. Alright, this is over once it's Dirty Joe's turn. Oh, you fucking kidding me. <laughs> oh my, and he critted I, again. I was thinking that, but oh. I was, like, there's no way that's gonna happen. Are you fu- <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Well. Alright, let's go back to the that corpse- That was perfect bad luck right there. Yeah. Mm. So back at the corpse quest. And buy some revival beads. I'll appraise those for you. 
What a bunch of bullshit that was. <laughs> there it is. That's the shimmy got my Tensei 4 experience right there. Any other business? What do you want to buy? What do you want to buy? This seven. No did you equip your uh, accessory that you bought? Yeah, I did it like right after I bought it. Okay. Hope none of these NPCs saw me get my ass split open over there. <laughs> How embarrassing. Oh, do I have to accept the quest again? Yeah. You do. Ah, uh, come on, dude. No, not the main quest. Yeah, I, I'm playing the uh, Japanese version, I definitely got stuck here because I didn't know you had to accept the quest. Oh, yeah, that would be really fucking confusing. I need to complete this quest so I can get one time succulent pork. <laughs> <laughs> Weird award. <laughs> All right, we're back at it. Let me quick save again. It's the same place. Yep. <clears throat> Be careful. Damn, that's a good sound effect though. Why'd I do that? I don't need Shang Zhao doing anything. Hmm. Wait, anything to take it down now. Hmm. Nice. God damn. I also want to say that the Super Bowl logo is bad this year. What uh what did it look like? Was it not just a, a big football? <laughs> well like they're that's just the Roman numerals with the trophy in the background. Oh right. Uh, that's so this year is fifty five, so it's L V, right? But they have the L and the V spaced, like uh with the trophy in the middle. So the trophy actually looks like it's an I. So at first glance it looks like it's trying to be Super Bowl fifty four. Oh that's not good. I feel like I should have thought that through. Oh my god, stop ambushing me. Oh, that didn't... That didn't reload it. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> so bad design still even happens. At like... Super mainstream level. Yeah. It should just be like the dancing ESPN robot, like a an LV <laughs> on his chest. <laughs> yeah. Do they still have that fucking thing? That's the fox. fox oh, robot. the fox one. That's what it is. Yeah. You should try and recruit Ipon Datura. Yeah, good idea. Uh. Aw, oh, fuck you. Oh. oh no. He's full of Todd McFarlane's hatred. <laughs> I almost said Seth McFarlane's hatred and that wouldn't have, uh, <laughs> wouldn't quite check out. Different context, you know. Yeah. Fuck, that's yeah, like acceptable. No, 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 that's just the that's that's the instant uh, rec recruitment. Yeah, price. yeah, I just didn't want to deal with them. Okay. All right. Oh, nice. Yeah, but when someone suggested to me that Ipan Dotoro was based on a spawn figure, like I laughed at first. It's like <laughs> no way. Impossible.
Did it slow down just now? Yeah, because the fucking Burrows came up and it just couldn't handle her. That's, that's so weird that that's, that's what caused him. Yeah. Oh, we got Augie Lau now. Um... Why I keep skipping those turns? Oh yeah, I did watch a uh, Violence Voyager like three hours ago. Oh cool. Did you also watch? What did you think of it? Uh, did you also watch the English dub? I did. Yeah, yeah. me too. It was pretty good. That's the, that's the only way it was available. Honestly. <laughs> yeah. I watched it like I don't have Amazon Prime, but you can watch it on Prime with ads. Which was uh, not like the ideal way to watch it, because like, every time something scary happens, then you have to watch an ad for Liberty Mutual Insurance. <laughs> Still, is... which which Liberty Mutual ads? Uh, the one the Limu Emu thing, oh, okay. Emu Limu, whatever the fuck it is. Emu Limu and Doug. Yeah, yeah, the classic the pair, <laughs> Abbott and Costello style. <laughs> <laughs> Need a more iconic too. <laughs> yeah. You might want to recruit the Yamato Shikame. Uh, she's like four levels higher than me. Ah, damn it. Yeah. Just on the lookout for those neutral demons. Um, but yeah, Violence Voyager is fucking wild. It was not what I was expecting at all. Mm -hmm. I mean, it really does deliver on the name. Yeah, for real. I don't know how much I want to spoil it. Mm -hmm. I will say it does break one of the cardinal rules of storytelling, which is uh, Chekhov's chimpanzee. <laughs> if, you, if you introduce a chimpanzee <laughs> in Act 1, and by Act 3, he has to have ripped someone's face off. And that just never, <laughs> never made good on it. It's, yeah, it's, it's recommended unless you dislike violence against children yeah I, I expect it to be like a very straightforward you know some kids wander into a weird place and just all die one by one but it goes mm -hmm. pretty hard direction away from that although that does also happen did it remind you of anything else uh, only like like I mentioned before uh, Yamishibai which is the other you know uh, like Showa era Kamishibai style animation. That's like weirdly popular. It has like seven seasons, I think. I did like uh, when the father like falls down from that cliff and the, the guy says, Not even a strong American can survive this <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> fall from this height. There's a really weird like. Not like anti foreigner vibe, but like, um, there, like an awareness of what's foreign and what's Japanese. Yeah. The whole thing had like a very strange semi comic tone. It was really interesting. Mm -hmm. I liked how at the end when they just fucking straight up blew up the paper cutout, that was, that was amazing. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. Like all the actual like liquid effects and shit was. Wild. Mm -hmm. Derek is also a really good name for a cat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, like I, I watched that the same night and I rented uh, Psycho Gorman. Uh, you know about that movie? I feel like I've heard of it. I don't have a good image of it in my head though. Uh, it's like a comedy where kids they essentially find like. A, like a Power Rangers villain in their backyard. Oh, I th yeah, I've, over I've, I've seen that, yeah. yeah. But I haven't seen it, I've seen like clips of it. Yeah. It's okay, it's not bad. It seems all right, yeah. yeah. We definitely don't really make that kind of but, movie anymore, at least. Mm -hmm. But I've been thinking more about Violence Voyager since I've seen it. It's and, fucking, it's a good one. A lot of like just a crazy images. Yeah, I watched the first season of Yamashibai uh, during Halloween, and it was really good. I just, I didn't know why it went on for seven seasons. It's kind of sucks that 
Apparently only the first one's good. Is that on Crunchyroll? Yeah, it is. It's like a like four minute horror anthology, four minute per episode. Mm. Yeah, I, I yeah I think we watched one of them, but uh, can't remember. Yeah, what they were now. Oh, here's the other guy. I can't remember how many of these corpses you have to fight. I think it's six. Oh, that feels that feels excessive though. Uh, three to six, so one, one, two, three, four, plus a fifth. And that one leads directly into the dollar hand fight. Okay. And yeah, violence voyager. Uh, the other thing it reminded me of was, like, Daijiro Morohoshi shit. What did he do? He did, uh, Ankoku Shinwa. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I was gonna say, like, I think Ankoku Shinwa is the one thing it actually reminded me of. Yeah. And the Burning Buddha Man looks, like, even more Morohoshi-esque. Mm. I don't know where you can actually watch that, but I think I'm gonna check it out. Yeah, four left. Fuck, stop with these ambushes. Ugh. I don't know anyone's weakness. Well, I can tell you. Uh, Macabre is weak against... Uh... Gun. <laughs> really? It's a weird one. Mm -hmm. And Night Stalker is weak against light. Oh, great. I guess Macabre is just weak to getting his kneecap blasted at point blank range. <laughs> it's a real unfortunate weakness. <laughs> yeah. Right, sweet. We're already about to level up again. How many are in this area? I think we got two already. It said, before you beat that one, it said four remaining. Yeah. Can I go down here? Or is it just gonna be another asshole blocking me? No. You should save, yeah. It's a good idea. What? What was that Fred Flintstone laugh? What? <laughs> <laughs> he was just sitting down to a healthy bowl of fruit. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. Bonnie. <laughs> I was waiting for one of us to say My that. <laughs> yeah. Yabba dabba do, delicious do. I was like, can I pull this off without sounding like Peter Griffin? But I don't <laughs> think I could. <laughs> oh, let me save. Alright, cool. Okay, here's the other one. Be careful. Let's see. Uh, Danike is running out of MP, but we'll power through. Oh, yeah, and I did find a way to, to watch the original Star Trek series uh, without paying for it. Uh, Hulu just 
like gave me another free month subscription, even though I already did that in October. <laughs> so, well, thank you for your thing. weirdly lax policies. <laughs> like I'm never. We don't care. We want you to enjoy yourself. Yeah, I'm. I'm sorry, Hulu. I'm never gonna pay for you. You're a very mediocre streaming service. <laughs> So far, you have not convinced me to pay you. <laughs> Although I will need so I'm not gonna watch 79 episodes of Star Trek in 30 days, though. Uh -huh. So maybe. Three targets left. Alright, let me read the description, the episode description of the second Star Trek Jesus. episode. It's, uh... It's called Charlie X. A powerful teenage boy wrecks havoc aboard the USS Enterprise. <laughs> a powerful teenage boy. My worst enemy. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, Tattoo Man's on me. Oh my god, he's Blight. Fuck. We run away. Oh man. You could try. He's gotta be weak to Augie, right? Because he has a, a Jack Frost tattoo. No. That logic, <laughs> <laughs> that logic didn't bear out. Uh, let me see Tattoo Man. Uh, he's only weak against uh, Darkness. God damn it. Surprisingly. Oh, shit, don't use- Oh, I used Blight again. Man, fuck you guys. Goodbye. Can't believe that worked. <laughs> I'll take it. But yeah, I am enjoying uh, Star Trek so far. It's like very relaxing for some reason. Also, in a lot of the close-ups of uh, for Will Shatner, they use like that super soft, high exposure lighting that they used to use for uh, like female leads throughout the '40s and '50s and '60s. Pretty funny. That they still use on Judge Judy for her close-ups. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> they really do that. That's awesome. Man, yep. I hate Judge Judy. She seems like a terrible person. Well, like, I think the real person is not terrible. Just, I hate the character. I just hate, like, the concept of, uh, you know, mean judge lady berates poor people yeah. for 30 minutes every day. Yeah, that's, I hate that. That's so... <laughs> it's fucking gross. It just gets in my crawl. Ugh. Oh, there he is. Snuggle down. Yeah, the first episode of Star Trek is about like this this alien that takes the form of a uh, like whoever the observer most wants to see, I guess, or just whoever the observer is most sexually attracted to, is what it seems like. And uh, like right at the start, they have one of those th throwaway crewmen who's just there to die. He sees her and she turns into like a like a blonde bombshell and he says I'm sorry you remind me of someone that I met on Wrigley's pleasure planet and Just like they don't no extrapolation or anything If they don't have like a full episode dedicated to Wrigley's pleasure planet, I'm gonna be pretty upset So Wrigley went from selling gum to owning a pleasure planet apparently yeah it's also really funny that that guy just like, hey, you remind me of a prostitute that, I've, <laughs> that I <laughs> frequented at one point. I had a close encounter with on the Wrigley's Pleasure Planet. Yeah. He didn't live long after that, though, which was unfortunate. Yeah. So we'll never know his tale. Or prosper. <laughs> yeah. uh, Star Trek is not something I've ever like sat down from the beginning to watch. Like, just seen 
random syndicated episodes over the years. Yeah. Seems like most people don't recommend the original series, but I really like shit from the late 60s, so I'm going to watch it. Mm. Two left. Right, two left. Oh, here's a get. They got the... This guy. <laughs> that was a good take. First take. Yeah, there's a scene at the end of that episode where Spock is like trying to convince McCoy that it's an alien and not like his former lover. And he goes, look, you're... <laughs> she wouldn't be able to handle this. And then he does like... Four consecutive two-handed strikes, like, right on her face, just fucking, like, beating away at her. <laughs> it's a really good scene. Like, obviously not even brushing against her, just, like, a full foot away from her face, but still. It's Vulcan wisdom. Yeah. <laughs> Vulcan wisdom, fucking throw hands immediately. <laughs> Oh, I'm so tired of fighting these fucking macabres. There's <laughs> <laughs> just no good way to, to approach it. Well, you still got a smirk. Nice. Yeah, in the second episode, not quite as good as the first one, but that powerful teenage boy does get up to some amusing antics such as <laughs> he just like like once he starts on his power trip halfway through the episode he just uh like a, a female crewman just sort of looks at him and he looks at her and just turns her into an iguana <laughs> <laughs> and he just That's like pretty powerful. yeah and like some other girl he just like takes her face off and she just starts screaming she has like this completely smooth sheet on her face now. It's just... it's crazy. The first half of that episode is very uncomfortable, because, uh... He, like, wasn't raised around humans, and his character... Mm -hmm. Uh, the way it's coded just feels like a teenager... Like, with a very severe autism spectrum, spectrum disorder. So it's pretty uncomfortable. Oh, okay. But then he starts, uh... He's using his psychic powers to just fucking, like, turn people into older versions of themselves and shit. It's pretty sweet. Does he command the bridge at any point? He tries to, yeah. That's when, uh... Bill Shatner takes his stand and tries to assault this teenage boy. Yeah, they, they had some different problems during that era. Yeah, as far as like things that have aged badly, mostly just the whole the whole portrayal of women <laughs> is pretty dire. Mm. And I realize like how hard they go on those mini skirts for all of the uh, the female crewmen. Yeah, should probably save again just in case. Uh... Yeah, good idea. <clears throat> I'm not gonna fight this guy, I'm just not gonna do it. You can keep chasing me. But I jog slightly faster than you. Alright, I don't think there's anything else in here. God damn it. That's right, they'll show up as uh, the Oni marks on the map if they are. Oh, that's right. Um, What level is Macabre? 25? I think he's 25. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah. Oh, we should heal, too. <clears throat> Damn, these guys. Just remember Tattooed Man's darkness weakness. <laughs> yeah, that'll come in handy. <laughs> I really hate how they disable guests for this, like, critical mission that obviously your partners would be involved with. Yeah, because, like, this is technically a 
a plot critical mission. Yeah. I'm sure they chime in once that guy turns into a dull hand, so. And then they just don't help, I guess. Honestly, I don't think they do. But we'll see. Uh, oh, you don't have. Mazan? Whatever. Oh, hey. Well, just uh, be a, yes. Oh shit! Oh damn it! He's yeah, he's. It, it, it doesn't matter. He'll give you a random demon. Oh, that's right. Yeah. This could be pretty useful. Oh yeah. Oh nice. I don't know what the fuck he's saying, but come on in. All right, time to fuse Bjanja. Bjanja. Yeah. Yeah, see what the uh, Sudama will make. Oh shit, we got Moragi too. Welcome to the Cathedral of Shadow. Well then. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Alright, I don't know why that happened. Alright. Oh, we can make Takeminakata. Ah, do it. Yeah. Oh, Zianko will be good for double hand. Oh too. shit! Yeah. Oh, we have six. Shit. Uh. Oh, Fangbreaker decreases attack. Maybe Counter that'll... might be okay. Counter? Hmm. Does Fangbreaker always yeah, decrease else. attack, or is it just? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That that's it's a minus one. Yeah, I'll take that then. Nice. Whoa. I want to hear you talk. Uh, let's see what the, the Sudama will make. Oh, that's right. These <laughs> fucking voice samples. Whoa. Make Daphne. Do I want to give away. Fortuna, though, she does have way more MP than her. We'll see what the, uh, the Kupatengu makes. Oh, Stonka. That might be good. It's like two useless demons becoming... She... I don't know, Nozochi seems like a uh, an appropriate evolution for Zutonshi. He does, yeah. I think I'd rather Kupatengu, though. <laughs> You're gonna cop a tanku. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta cop this fucking tanku. Oh. Taunt? No, that's never worth it. Well. I don't know. It might be. Yeah, we have enough space. It's like it's. It's better than pulling pa, so. <laughs> Yeah. Shock, though. Like. That'll be good for the. Double hand fight, at least. Yeah. Accident. Accident. Nah. Oh. Too slick. I think you're too low level to get any of the, uh, right. the heroes. Yeah, I think so too. I think Yoshitsune is the first one. He's like level 40 something, isn't he? I think he's late 30. Well. Let me see. <clears throat> okay. Oh, come on already. Hey, more of these guys. Hero. Yeah, he's level 36. That's not bad. It's nice that they took down... Took Yoshitsune down a peg after his, uh... 
It's a ridiculously <laughs> broken appearance in Persona 4. Yeah. Oh, that's. I remember sucks. seeing all the complaints that. Where's Hoso Toby? <laughs> yeah. Fuck. I didn't people play his uh, SP version. Nah, dude. I like how. Like, jumping across some boats led to, like, an overpowered attack. <laughs> yeah. Oh, don't. Oh, thank God. Um, I don't really want to waste MP on this shit. I wonder how they'll do Medo, uh, Medo in SMT5. Uh, that's a good point. I really do, do wish we could have like a, an actual location for the Cathedral of Shadows. Mm -hmm. But I also realize it's just so much more convenient this way. Yeah. I mean, they, they could have a location that does like different stuff that's more... More specialized. I don't know what that could be. Even. Yeah. Oh man, he called up another one of these. Like, never get rid of the ad fusion, but yeah, make it just make it kind of a uh, make it kind of special, much more moody. Yeah, those locations always have such strong ambiance. It's really. Mm. Kind of a bummer to lose it. Well, think of it like uh, the demons will be in 3D again. So. Oh, that's right. It'd probably be more incentives actually, like when they do the animations for them to appear in some kind of space. Yeah, I think so too. I right, just yeah. Are you fucking no? Okay, canceled out in time. Can I run away yet? No. Oh my god. I was also thinking, like, what we've seen so far of the Tokyo and SMT5, it looks so generic. Like, oh yeah, just ruined. I think that's more. Yeah, like it, it's just more incentive for them to have different places this time around. Yeah, that may have been affected differently and have different aesthetics. They can make it work. Oh boy, that's too long. Burrows. Like, um, like the first trailer, they're in, I think, Shinagawa Station. I think that was it. Yeah. A, a bullet train stop. So basically, I just hope they go to Kyoto and a decently designed. Uh, Fujin Raijin in there. It's probably wanna. Is it domain? Do you wanna go on? You don't wanna, yeah. You don't, yeah. Oh, I don't wanna go there. Can you go to a safe space and actually. Oh, you can't. You're not on touchscreen. You yeah. can't actually. I can, the map. I can use the touchscreen, though, with, uh. I think just like the mouse. Yeah, so. Go to the area where you you weren't before. Uh, no, I think the I think the corpses should still up show up anywhere you are in anyway. Yeah, Flair. Uh, remind me of a tweet that I saw, like in reaction to the the trailer that just said SMT has like a thousand demons in one storyline. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, don't want to do that. Are you still following me? Holy shit. This is just the entrance, right? Yep. <laughs> no, I'm good. Dirty Joe's all up in it. Once more. Oh my god, stop, please. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. Maybe to the right again. Just 
anything this can make this. This one might show up in the very center of this area. Are we on the last one or the second to last one? I can't remember. Yeah, check to the left there. Oh, shit. Nice. Oh, this fucking... These guys. <laughs> these motherfuckers. <laughs> Hey, you're only four levels away from being able to recruit them. Um, I would never fight them again. Thank God. Yeah, tattooed man. MVP. I like how he was based on not even a particularly notable Yakuza movie. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, shock costs so much MP. Might be worth it just because you should be near. So to do it. Oh, he leveled up, so it doesn't even matter. Bad company? Similar bad company, yeah. Resummons. Uh, it's, it's awful. It's terrible. <laughs> yeah. It's the worst. Do I want any of this? I don't think you do. Unless you want Zanma instead of Zan. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I do. Alright, cool. Can at least make the shortcut. Nope. Oh, narrow hallway. God damn you. There's nothing ever in this hallway. No? Yeah, it was just that. The uh, the Fred Flintstone guy. Mm -hmm. I never know what to use because I don't know how much MP I'm willing to waste, but I guess just all of it now. Uh, Tattooed Man appears in that, like, Yakuza area in Devil Summoner. Um, the same one that has Killer Chopper. Oh, yeah. So, I, it's really just a movie crew. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is a bad situation to be in. Yeah, like Flair says, like, they were trying in Devil Summoner. Yeah. It really helps when they were doing mostly new... Uh, rosters for every game. Yeah. <clears throat> Zombie cap. Zombie cap the the legend himself. <laughs> if you can get a zombie cop in this game, like it, it's it's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> um the undeads are Incredible fusion. For some reason. I don't know, I guess they wanted to give them some sort of utility. Mm-hmm. Um, oh yeah, they're pretty hard to get. Do I not have... Oh, I have it. Does this poison also work? Yeah. Right, let's go over here then. No, no. It's gotta be in here. Gotta avoid it. Okay. We did it. It's gotta be somewhere here. Let's pan around. Oh, here's a place I didn't go to. Shit. Nice. How did I miss that? Master. Give yourself another save. Oh. What is... Oh, that's just like the obstacle thing. Yeah, I'm gonna save.
Yeah, remember those? <laughs> <laughs> Is the one up on the roof here? I believe so. I don't think he could be anywhere else, at least. No. Oh, I got him. I shook him. Yeah, these are necessary because, you know, the, the enemies aren't aggressive enough already. <laughs> be careful. Oh, Mirage. Yeah, some T4's roster is like. Yeah, it's just a. Port over everything from Strange Journey. <laughs> yeah. We'll make some good choices and some questionable choices for the rest. Oh, shit. Honestly, the Tattooed Man fan on the stack is probably someone like A.G. Ishida. Oh, fuck. Didn't go well. Otherwise, he's a pretty rad dude with good taste. <laughs> yeah. Even more shit now. Yeah, Iktitnike was the first guy in the SMT world to say shit like shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't wanna. Oh, I guess I don't need Augie. Right. Speed lesson. Like, what the hell kind of skill was that? <laughs> Shall be by 10, yeah. That's what I want. Oh, at least we're upgrading our stuff. All right, now there's one left. I still have a bunch of... What is the next Megami after Fortuna? Uh, that's a good question. Don't remember. Um, Here's a ladder. Oh, it's half or. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, oh, wow, that guy just zoomed right past me. Bad path bonding on that enemy. Uh, I was looking out. Did you go up on the roof? I think there's two of them. Yeah, there's two. I got like the item from the the okay. first one. Whew, I was about to say if that didn't reset the enemies <laughs> on my ass, that is too much. All right. All right get ready. Two for one. Might as well do a hard save too. I would heal my MP because I have some chakra drops. Right. All right, we got this. Shit, Fortuna. She should level up after this uh, fight. Oh, that's true. Yes. Nice. Oh yeah, they both got it. Perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't learn anything. Hell yeah. Give me that succulent pork. <laughs> 
I guess that would be like a delicacy if it's real pork at this point. Is it Kentucky Rawa? Yeah, I don't think so. I think they have like their own item. Uncalled for you twerps. Oh dear. I think you'd better be careful around this one. With things this messed up, I'm better off becoming a demon. What's this dude's problem anyway? Like go go become a demon like fifteen meters away from us. <laughs> That's a real leaf going from We got no hope trapped here in Tokyo. Damn that Tayama. Him and his Ashurakai. He's betrayed us all. He babbles about some like that delivery. Him and his uh, uh, Asher. <laughs> this guy is, he's like one of those, we used to have Steve Jobs, Johnny Cash, Bob Hope, and now we have no jobs, <laughs> no cash. Oh, man. Don't let him make everyone in Tokyo into cowards, blind to the truth. I'm going to release them all from Tayama's slavery. I hate this cancel culture. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cancel this. I'm going to turn into a Dolahan. Yeah, I'm gonna cancel my life. Kill anyone who gets in my way. I'll show you. He's literally swallowing the red pills, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if this game were more popular, there'd be lots of hot takes like, oh my god, SMT4 predicted Gamergate. <laughs> yeah. Why can you remember things when you were human? Yeah, I don't. I don't know. Please allow us to aid you. Well, I've already written quite enough. On <laughs> I guess so. Regardless, it hardly absolves him from turning others into demons. No, no, I was wrong. They do appear to quote against him. Oh yeah. Then again, the quest is technically over, so. That's true. You know your precious Tokyo. He's not here, man. Smash it all up. Finally, I'm like a level 28 demon. I can do this. <laughs> uh, double hand can use uh, Muduon. Uh, that's not so good. Just, use, just, just tech. Just. Go after her. Yeah, Dolahan is like a perfectly fine design, but I mean the posing is boring. It's not that interesting of a take on the Dolahan concept. So you know, it's, it's fine if she comes. It's fine if she comes back. No, but you shock, 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 shock. Oh right, yeah. Perfect. A damn four hits. MVP. <laughs> It's one of my Star Wars figures that does that. <laughs> yeah. Wow, you suck, dude. <laughs> I am just picking whatever the dickhead option is, so yeah. Just do it. God that damn. was like a self own swallowing that red pill, really. Yeah, I feel like. It would have been easy. They're harder to beat just as like a hunter with gun skills. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. Koba Tengu is going to turn into Karasu Tengu. Just as we do. I wonder how they came to be called the unclean ones. Looks like the quest is going well. Have you seen this place, Isabel? Uh, oh, right. We're looking for the bookstore. <laughs> Got kind of sidetracked there. Succulent pork, one remaining. I guess that was also a quest that I was on. The quest for the succulent pork. I just realized I've had a Yoda figure on my desk the whole time. Oh shit. Yoda is real. <laughs> uh oh. You're not fighting any more of these guys. Yeah, 
Oh yeah, use the red fill as like a, a sensu beam. Yeah, I, I would like to see a side quest about like a suicide pack group. Like they would just swallow red pills <laughs> to see what random demons they turn into. Yeah. God, that would suck. Like your friend turns into a fucking like Shiva for some reason. You turn into <laughs> Fuji. <laughs> yeah. Oof. <laughs> it's definitely a feels bad man kind of moment. Yeah. Alright, let's heal up. What's your blood? What? <laughs> What's your pleasure? Hmm. Parsley sprig. I don't know. I don't know about that. Isabeau is the kind of person who like puts paprika on her scrambled eggs and thinks it's the fanciest <laughs> thing in the world. <laughs> She's like all natural. <laughs> yeah. Organic. If you've got business, then hurry up. It's open we both see each other alive again. All right. I now... just got a big dark lighter figure in as well. Oh, for real? Sweet. I just wanted to remind people that his name is Biggs Darklighter. It's fucking crazy. Luke Skywalker and Biggs Darklighter. We're destined for great things. I'm sorry, <laughs> it ain't happening. I do that. Oh. The demons on the other side. That is, unless you help out. Shame Luke's dad blew up Biggs. It's off pretty harsh. Yeah. We'll give you the G Wait, is this? Okay, here we're like, we're getting into the... We're getting in the good stuff here. Oh god, that's right. Yeah, I'll off it for you. That'd be nice. One of our boys went on ahead with some hired hunters. The more the better, they say. This is like I could do this voice. That's what I heard. <laughs> <This> is... <laughs> Register that as a new quest on the list. <laughs> We're walking in. Yeah. Forget about it. <laughs> this is a real New York pizza. <laughs> Hey, Tina, get out of here. <laughs> this is New York. <laughs> oh, fuck the music. You're free to pass now, so I'll be counting on you. You mess with one of us, you mess with all of us. <laughs> the real New York scumbag. All right, Quibico is uh, weak against fire. It stands to reason. Pretty amazing weakness for a scarecrow. <laughs> I do like the uh, like big open area leading up to the the government building though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey. Listen, I don't have time for your world building. I have to go kill this uh scarecrow. Whoops. Uh, oh, this guy's starving. It's too bad. <laughs> it's a huge toilet in the back there, too. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, what the fuck? That's like right next to the bunk. It's a bad place for it. I didn't mean to talk to you again, dude. Well, a uh, hunter or a depressed woman? Talk to the depressed one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the choice. It's a pretty silly thing. I can't even remember what it is. Uh, hard to explain. Well, we'll get there. Have you seen a girl? Yeah, that gives me a lot to go on. Enough with this one star food. I can go up here. You got item. Like grimoire, is that for the app points or is that just XP? That's EXP. Oh, right. It's not even worth it, really. It's does it sell for anything? Save it for when, like you're save it when. No, they I don't think they really even sell for that much. Yeah. 
Save them for when you're near a level that you want to get to, I guess. Yeah. But then, like, you have to get into a battle to actually gain the level. Oh, that's right. They're terrible. Yeah, I'm also got a stacks of vending machines, but uh, it's all <laughs> like Mr. Pib and RC Cola, so it just sucks. <laughs> well, the uh, well, the water that filters through his body, you know, yeah. has to pick up some flavor along the way. It tastes like Mountain Dew Major Melon. <laughs> <clears throat> Pokari sweat flavor. Masakato has become an e girl, and now he's selling these like bathtub water. <laughs> Oh, I really thought I could get around them. And it's the exact same enemy configuration, too. Also, this is in the underground, and there's demons. Yeah, I guess they're just... I thought that wasn't supposed to happen. I they just don't care about this area too much. Um... Skip, I guess. Mermaid... is not the worst thing in the world. It's pretty bad, though. If, if it became the official design, I think we would have all groaned, but... I don't know. It's better than, like... It's better than what we have. an embarrassment. Yeah. The actual one. Ugh. It also seems just like a concept design that... You could just talk... If you, you could just talk to Kobotengu. Oh, one. fuck, that's right. Okay. I don't no. need your quest. Oh, hell yeah. It's like... I just want mermaids that look like legal adults. <laughs> yeah. Is that so hard? Yeah, the fact that it's a good gag just makes me think the doi rattled off that design not actually expecting it to be, like, implemented as the final design. Get that. Oh, that thing just crashed right into me. Hey, it's Kiki Moore. Oh, shit. It's Kanaku's Subject. crib notes Kanaku number. Crib notes. Four? I was going to say four or five, yeah. One was Ouroboros, two is Master Therion, three. I can't remember what the third one was. Oh, don't attack. Yeah, we're gonna recruit her. But going by my, I was looking through my giant bomb images again, and I think the canonical first Kanako's crib notes was uh, Albion. Oh, I think so. Yeah, that does sound right. Certain Abyss Giant, like it's it's so easy. It's right there. Kiki, yeah, Kiki Moore was three, and Dekarabia was number four. Uh, you can ask me for other dollar bills. Yeah, you can have them. I don't care. No. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> what did I do? Did I just, like, pretend to slit his throat? <laughs> <laughs> you got a ketchup packet. It's like, see? Look at how he's dying. Yeah. Look at the agony. <laughs> I'll take the life of Walter. Oh, okay, sure, sure. That'd be great. Like, sorry, Walter. You just fucking cap him in the head. Sorry, I need this thing made of sticks. It's better than you are. So. Yeah. It's alright, Walter. We have the technology. We can bring you back. You'll be faster. Stronger. Alright, save again. Let's not do all that again. Yeah, fuck that. You might as well get a healing. Yeah, I think so. At the, uh, at the Hunter Association. Let's do that first. 
I could talk about my new SMT theory. What is it? For a little bit. It's that almost all, like, what? I, like I've been searching for things that would have, have just led me to different articles and such written by all kinds of different Megami Tensei fans. If you've got business, and, hurry up and spit it if out. you look at them, study them, like, there's business, really no cohesion to we both see each other like, alive again. Like, interpretations and perceptions of certain things. And uh, I, I just kind of had to blame it on like most of the games we've gotten in the West being kind of bad informers of what SMT actually is. Oh, right, you mentioned that. Like, people always ask, like, what's the best SMT to start with? And of what's available, like, I guess I do have to agree that SMT4 is probably the best one. But yeah. Ideally, I think the best starter is SMT1. Just because it goes over so many of hmm. the important basics of the series, like, and really defines what alignments are, um, the stakes, and just the world building. Yeah, thematically, it's like the best place you could possibly start. Mm -hmm. And it itself is the most cohesive out of maybe any of the games, too. It feels like it, yeah. Because, like, looking back on it, I think Nocturne was the wrong place to start. Just because it's deliberately trying to do things differently. Uh oh. No, it's not after me. Plus we. Plus we got maniacs, which uh, just funneled everybody to the true redeeming ending as the legitimate ending. Yeah. Which was okay for like the first ten years or so, but it just I just feel like it's. Itch stick has gone on too long as like a standard. It was never really meant to be that way. Yeah, the fact that it was billed as a uh, Lucifer's call in Europe also was a bad sign. Then yeah. this game has its art and narrative foibles and Apocalypse does too. Shoot. And then Redux does uh, its Conoco erasure thing. Oh, that's right. Fuck that. So, like, go back and just have to consider the strange journeys maybe the best instructor of what SMT actually is. Yeah. Even then, probably a lot of people who would bounce off that style of dungeon crawling, but who wouldn't mind, yeah. like, uh, SMT4 or Nocturne, maybe. It's just a shame that there's no like easy way to play S T one. Yeah. It's a good lean story, it has all the elements there. And plus at the end Lao Tzu explains the themes of the whole story. Mm -hmm. So it's really hard to miss. <laughs> Lao Tzu coming at, out at the end of S T one is just like that doctor who explains Norman Bates' whole deal at the end of a uh, Psycho. <laughs> God, that was so crazy. Like, I saw it for the first time last Halloween, and he's just mm -hmm. like a full six minutes of explaining this very obvious, <laughs> like plot line. Yeah, there's no faith in the audience at all. Just a little too subversive. <laughs> Oh man, Carol hit. <laughs> what the fuck? Why is that move called Carol hit? I was hit? gonna say, what the fuck kind of name is Carol hit? Is it really just Carol hit in Japanese? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, so bizarre. Are they gonna miss again? Just pass and let the. Dirty Joe and. Yeah, they got it. Oh, sweet. Nice. Bonus. Hope we have enough space for him. Oh, you don't have demon levels, oh, so shit, work. that's right. I do have like 30 map points. Let me... And it's worth worth saving for 
uh, skill augment. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah. I know that Orcus has uh, Carol hit as well, which is funny. Just because mm -hmm. he's big. Uh, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, there it is. To the left over here. Alright, I can just talk to Kimura. Stop trying to give me this quest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the SMT is perfectly suited to being like many things to many people, but unfortunately that's not what I see a lot of the time. I just see people unfortunately I just like reading things wrong. <laughs> yeah. SMT is the, the badass through, mature through no Pokemon where you kill your yeah, friends. <laughs> through no fault of their own most of the time. Yeah. Uh -oh. Still by the ear. I think that's where Nozomi appears. I'm almost positive, yeah. What is this anyway? Can I look at that? No, it's not Vassarin. I don't think you want to go down there. What is this anyway? Oh, there's, I, I, oh there's fuck. It, nope. It's a manhole. Why does it just lead directly? Whatever. Oh, are you for real? Yeah. Hey, it's your friend. It's Ubu. Ubu. More like... Best demon. More like Ubu, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I don't know. Ubu eats. Cool new app. Oh man, it's really funny that the Kikimora just sees the other Kikimora in your party and just like looks her up and down and goes, hmm, not bad. And just runs away. <laughs> get out of here. The good looking Kikimora. Sure, give me the fucking quest. That's a new quest. That's a good one, but we're not gonna do it. Oh right, it doesn't actually <laughs> make her disappear. You can talk to her again. Okay, yeah. perfect. Not bad. You get that uh, like three packs a day voice. <laughs> demons are manifestations of people's perception of them is like very like oh the, the angels are actually accurate <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> fucking it's the worst oh man my thing is stuck my thing I mean my my, uh, my earphone there we go it could have been very bad depending on what thing <laughs> yeah <sighs> Uh, it really sends you far away if you decide to jump down in that manhole, huh? Mm -hmm. uh, once you get through here, it's not. It's, you'll be right there. Yeah, you can't fight anything here, at least. I like Super Sentai, therefore, everything is Super Sentai. <laughs> yeah, it checks out. Are there any lingering questions about this game at all? Like... Like mysteries, or...? That, yeah, like things that don't sh that straight up don't make sense, or...? I... I feel like we've touched on everything, basically. Yeah, I think so, too. Hmm. Yeah, I can't think of anything that wouldn't just feel like extreme nitpicking. At least, like, given that they didn't make any changes to Nocturne, except when they patched them in, ironically enough. So, <laughs> yeah. That if they did release SMT1 again, like, I 
feel like it would not be molested with that much. I think the problem there is that it's so much easier to just add like shitty character portraits and stuff to the uh, the sprite based games. Right, if Doi did them, they'd, they'd be fine. But uh, if they were not done by Doi and they were done by Atlas Heart Team, uh... I think just like any portraits in general would damage the atmosphere of that game. That's true, because it's like the emptiness and yeah. the feeling of isolation is very important. The so. small, like sparse sprites are a big part of that, I think. Mm -hmm. Like even when they just use the sprites to represent characters in SMT4, I think it's way better than the the actual character portraits. Mm -hmm. Oh fuck! No, I knew we either was weak to lightning or. Was very much not weak to lightning. Yeah. Remember that, like, lightning for some reason is. Is earth, yeah. The, yeah, the proxy earth element for some reason. <laughs> Why can't they just bring back the Terra spells from Digital Devil Saga? It's a good those? point, yeah. <laughs> the fuck happened there? Oh, nope. Can't trick me again. Uh, what are you actually weak to? Yeah, Bufu. Perfect. Yeah, when did the Biblical Angel garbage start? It became a mean... It feels very modern. Yeah, it feels like... It's gone for like two years, maybe? I don't know. Because, uh, I don't think any, like... Medieval monks were like illustrating like spiked balls as like the true forms of angels, like someone had a vision. Yeah. Listen, they didn't know as much about theology as this guy that I saw on conceptart.org. <laughs> <laughs> Space battles. <laughs> yeah. Aquapot. They sell for a decent amount. That was a gold. What the hell is this, a gold jet again? Is that just I a think valuable? Jet is also, yeah. yeah, it is. A golden craft. Let me revive, uh. Homeboy. Kobatanku. <laughs> Yes, Barry Giant, send me that if you find that. Yeah, the Amamiya angels do just look like some neural network shit. <laughs> Deep fake Merkaba. They're, they're, they're just missing like the dog faces that sometimes appear. Yeah. This angel does not exist. <laughs> That's the, the, the that's the only way you can go. You have to go up and around. Oh really? Damn. Mm -hmm. You have to go on the right side this time. I think. Um. I do like this well, big old vista that you get here. It's worth. No, I must be wrong. It's worth checking around regardless. Okay. Oh, fuck. I think there's a weapon in here, too. Oh, yeah, I believe so. As long as it's not a hammer, it might be worth getting. Yeah, the slowdown... Not that bad with this track. It's already pretty, like, downbeat and ambient. Whoa. Oh man, I just clicked on this X does not exist and I got this waifu does not exist. Oh no. That's too bad, man. You have to think rid of that computer now. 
Well, uh, I guess you can take the stream by yourself. <laughs> yeah. See you guys later. Take care, dude. I'm pouring the gasoline <laughs> on my computer now. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ugh. Alright, save, 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 save. Yeah, I'm just gonna explore the area in front first. Uh oh. He's gonna jump. These film reels. Oh shit. Yeah, let me open up the shortcuts. Oh man, it's Quancha. And then level four dwarf, because I guess it's all just G Rise. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Uh, see, they were thinking about thematics when they were making these areas, right? Yeah. Honestly, that's so a that means they were an acceptable amount of effort. Uh -huh. But uh -huh. then in Ikebukuro, you have know, the Chinese demons versus the giant Japanese. Demons. Yeah. Not great. <laughs> They wouldn't have done that. Never forget. God, the fact that like once that scenario was over, the area is populated with exclusively Japanese demons is fucking. It's bad. It's bad that they paid that much yeah. attention to it. Yep. Personally, I don't think it would be very hard for an AI to come up with, like. A description of like a waifu anime. Yeah. Oh shit. I don't want to fight you again. I even hate that waifu is becoming like a part of the lexicon that I'm not even blinking saying it. It sucks, dude. It's <laughs> fuck, I hate it. <laughs> Yeah, like the concept of foreignness fucking 25 years into this apocalypse is so stupid. Perfect. Good job. Wait, do we? No, we don't have the Sudam anymore. Um, check swap. Let's see. Now we fused him. He became, he became Koopa Tango. Right? Yeah. I think you got your Augie. I do have Augie, yeah. Oh, fuck, he's weak at that. That's right. That was a waste of the last MP that he had. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, so the Reds again, like... Hope you're prepared. They're just harvesting human brain matter, right? It's and just They're delicious. spraying it with some of the Yasu Magatsi juice or something? Yeah. That sweet brain juice. So really, like, the human brain matter that they're going to try and eat anyway, once you get on the surface, is kind of inconsequential, because, like, it seems like the differentiating factor is the Yasuo Magatsi juice. Yeah. Gas, whatever. So why don't they just create pellets with the Yasuo Magatsi stuff? Is it is, that, is it the gas that like actually helps turn it into a pellet form instead of just uh or something like that? I don't I'll give them the benefit of the doubt and say that they still manufacture the pellets. Yeah. But it's like what gives them like what makes them prefer the red pills is the gas. Is so really good? I'm like saying like can they just have stations set up with <laughs> <laughs> The gas, so that they could all get a whiff of it, and yeah. get high for a little bit, and then it's forget what they were doing. Mm. Anyway, uh, who do we need for MP? Yeah, yeah, we're at the point where like any future stuff, like predictions, like count on the dystopias being more correct than the utopias. Yeah. Uh oh, let me. Save here. Yeah, if they display that kind of self-awareness, Sai Guy, that would be 
so amazing that it's basically impossible. <laughs> it really is. I just don't have that level of... Oh, fuck. Another true New Yorker. That was a choice just to kill these guys or to just fight the demon straight away. I don't. I don't know. Demon that has seized the Metropolitan Government Office. Oh, good timing. You must be the ones who volunteered for the quest. Why does Jonathan care there that this is see? the Metropolitan Government Office? It side. doesn't really matter anymore. <laughs> I know you're not that just you know, we had to get that exposition out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> He's in this building. Come on, we'll make it worth your while. Wait a minute, is this Tokyo? You got enough oh of those red God. pills, you don't gotta eat humans. Plus, they give you a pretty good buzz. See, they give you a good buzz. Yeah, that's it. Alright, double D, calm down. You ate all of my friends! Devouring others to live is the way of nature. Let's go, Abiko. Yep. <laughs> The demon of wisdom. Mm. No, I, I just love that the descriptions of Kui Vika and like the Kajiki is... It, it, it's, his whole character is literally dependent on him not moving because he's a scarecrow yeah. in the ground. So of course, this guy gave him legs and he looks like he's like, ambulatory. <laughs> No GMOs for Quibico. <laughs> I think I think that's literally what a caption on one of the images in Identity Crisis <laughs> Three. <laughs> that makes sense. Sheesh. No, no, I don't want to be. You, you can say that again. Oh my! What is this Scooby Doo ass shit? Zoinks! <laughs> yeah. Our negotiations Fiend Monsanto. Take Quibico's mask off. And it turns out he was the town prospect all along. <laughs> it's Tayama. What are you doing here? <laughs> uh. What is. I kill her either way. It's a. It's a. The false dichotomy. It's just, it's offensive. <laughs> so, like, when you look at the red pills, he says that they're unnatural. So, so, literally, the only unnatural part of them is the gas. That's straight from a god, though. Oh no. I don't know. Yeah, it just as like a vaguely Shinto themed rock monster, this isn't a bad design. But as a wise old mm. scarecrow, it's not great. But I will say, like, of all the demons, like the style, Kuibiko's style, art style, actually fits maybe the best out of all of them. Yeah, it's actually like nicely rendered, especially the, uh, like the sand modeling on his hand and shit. Oh, don't raccoon to me, bro. Shit. But it's just like, it's another design that misses the point. Yeah. Then again, fighting a Japanese scarecrow wouldn't have made for an exciting boss fight either, so. He <laughs> just shouldn't be a boss at all. Yep. Yeah, they really made, they made really weird choices for the... Uh, defense deities. Yeah. Um. Yeah, just heal. Oof. Uh oh. Oh fuck! Every one of them hit. Dirty Joe, you. you dirty kidding me? All right, let's just. Does someone have healing know-how? Pretty sure one of them do does. 
Gotta get rid of those minus twos. Yeah, that sucks. Oh, who has it? I don't... Well, I look at Taunt again. Okay, right. Yeah. Alright, so we have our hit all the way up. What the hell am I doing, man? Oh, shit. Yeah, fire only. Oh, we got to reload this save. <laughs> oh, you fool. <laughs> oh, great. All I can do is, um... Oh, who the hell has... The good news, he only has about 2,000 HP. Oh, shit. We, we have, like, 1,600 left, so that's... I don't think we can do it this time without, uh... Without uh, 30 uh, Use Fang Breaker. A good idea. Yeah, just attack. Nice. Dekunda. Oh shit, he's got the Dekunda. Well, at least he wasted his turn, basically. We can still do this. We can pull this off. Do we... Yeah, we still... Still down some defense. Um, oh, crate, he's out of MP there, too. Oh, that was okay. Nice. Wait, now I can't heal. Oh, fuck. Not enough! Not enough! Oh, yeah, I keep aiming at Taka oh. Minigata. Could you be the new Zutun Shay MVP? Oh, fuck, he has Retaliate, that's right. Fuck, that sucks. That's really gonna come in clutch for him. Yeah, I'm just gonna auto. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, Jesus, that thing Flare posted. It's crazy. Let me see. Oh, what the hell? Why is this on the Megaton bot? It's like AI generated Kaneko. <laughs> the cherry tits? Jeez. Man. Are you consulting your demons? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm detecting a strong demon ahead. Probably it's safe state. After this scene. <clears throat> Come on, y'all. The goddess of cherries. Reminds me like, uh... You know that guy, Ringo? If he like, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe something he draw. Did a real good job. Yeah, the rendering on that one isn't as good as his, his stuff though. That's the same as it was before, so let's save. C slot 2. Maybe start with some Sukukaja. Because he's is, always going to be lowering your defense. That is what I did last time. It hmm. didn't go to grill. Well, actually. Oh, what else can fucking Kopatengu do? just crazy easy to fool people into thinking that Kaneko drew something that he didn't. Yeah, look at that Evangelion thing. <laughs> yeah, the one that's like not even remotely plausible. 
Oh man, these <laughs> these people look like mannequins. It must have been Kanaka. Yeah. <laughs> okay, as long as Dirty Joe is hanging in there. We're at minus one. Just think you could use some diorama. Really could, yeah. Oh, Lucy busted off two Aguilaos this time before he died. Oh man. Oh fucking look at me using him. He has Agu. Oh man. Not enough. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that was satisfying for some reason. Oh, that was good turn. Great turn. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh, you should get him on this turn. Uh, I think so. Woof. He should be in the red now. Yeah, he is. Oh, you're done, dude. Alright, waste your turn. Is uh, Jonathan gonna get him? Oh, yeah. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Jonathan Redemption Arc. Oh, yes, that, uh, what, that Twitter account just auto follows. Oh, is that what it is? Huh. Um, the one you used for the, uh, uh, Mina no Kuji thing. Oh, is that the one where it's like a picture of him holding the, the Dekarabia, or is that something else? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. He's holding, like, the base, the hexagram base for the Demi King. Oh, that's it, yeah. I think. Uh, Poltergeist. I was talking to Poltergeist. Zero, 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 one, or two, and... They were like, uh, kind of got like the active. I was like, mm, I noticed that it's just auto following people. So. Yeah. He's not alive. He's not using an account that's like 0314. <laughs> no. Oh. Serves him right. He wouldn't have had to die if he didn't pick a fight with us. Well, then, I got a party to prepare. It's to celebrate us taking back the west exit. You kids did good. Take I have one vocal register that I use for everything. <laughs> mm. Was our decision to slay Kuebiko true the best one? Probably. Congratulations on completing the quest. He was talking about how much he loves to eat people earlier, so... I love to get a talisman that allows me to make further progress in this JRPG. <laughs> we need the god of the land. Alright. Oh, I want to look up there. What happened? Oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, when, once we finally find Kanako, he's just been scribbling like uh, Mothman on his walls in the, the closet. Yeah, they keep him like locked up in a, sto a storage room, and every now and then they just like push a plate with uh, a lemon and a can of Diet Dr Pepper on it, and they just uh, <laughs> subsist on that. Wait now. Sweet. Ah. It's Fortuna. Fortuna's time to be fused, though. Skip.
get to the safe zone. And the next challenge is going to be Shi Wang Mu, I believe. Oh man. Maybe we should save the most racist part of the, the game for the, the next stream. Yeah. Might be a good call. Yeah. What's your blood? Yeah, they'll, re they'll release a new uh, Daisojo design, and it's just kind of goes skeleton. <laughs> it's just it's a realistic photo. Uh, what? Sh me? What am I actually supposed to do next? Oof! No. <laughs> Have I still not killed Ose? Let me go back. Let me do that then. Yeah. Heal Did you heal up? Yeah, we're oh, here. Yeah, I just saw you do it. I'm detecting a strong demon ahead. Do you want to go on? Oh shit. I saved while she was <laughs> saying good. that. Yeah. What? Oh shit. All right, bud. Hey, good old. Numbers aren't everything in a fight. A showy horde doesn't always get the job done. I think I'm better off focusing on the <clears> quality <throat> of my demon. <laughs> You're... It's my quality, a sexy demon. Oh, don't on me. Yeah, sure. Use him, Medea, or Medea. Just like buff, dirty, dirty Joe. Yeah, good idea. There we go. I gotta keep healed. Most unlucky for you. Damn, not bad. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Damn, Walter, you're still alive. Hundred percent good. Where's? Bang breaker, sure. I hope you're prepared. Ooh, shit. Uh, yeah, he's done for. Awesome, thank you for the clip, Saga. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Take that. Fuck. Oh man, it's a great that cardboard <laughs> cut out of the way. <laughs> it's a great animation. Yeah, holy shit. Alright, we finally got this friggin' terminal open. Looks like the quest that time is a cinch. Do we want to go to the club? Actually, is the club just Sky Tower? Yeah, I think so. Kind of sucks that we never have any reason to go to the club then. Is it Sky Tower or Mikado? Oh, it's Mikado. Yeah, it's Mikado. Oh, that makes more sense. Dun, dun. Uh, shit. Let's see here. Oh, I should probably heal again. What level are you now? I think 24. Let me check. If you've got business, it's open. We both see each other alive again. Alive again. Oh, <laughs> yeah, he really doesn't seem to care for it. <laughs> 24. Alright, first let's try fusing Fortuna. Ooh. Chill out. 
Need a. Let's go to stall my hand, because now I'll be pretty loose. That land's like level 25. Higher than that, I believe. Uh, well, you don't have a single demon of it, so. so. Oh, yeah, damn. Oh yeah, Delahan is like the highest demon in the ghost land. Oh shit, that's right. I guess that makes sense. Fuck, we're doing it here. We can do Zerons. Oh, I can only... Well, actually, we don't need... I don't, I, don't, I don't think Daphne is going to be worth it. Um, she does have way more MP. Should be good spotter later on. Yeah, that's true. I don't like her Trees. only weak to fire. Uh, how how much do you have to go until level twenty five? Let me check. You can you can check your status from there. Oh, you could. Oh man. Now oh, I have a lot, like all of it. Oh, uh, Okay. Yeah, they really jack those level ups for the uh, new guys. That's what you want. You don't actually want people to be able to use your uh, your new demons. <laughs> Forgive me, Niles. Yeah, David Hyde Pierce. Gonna get our ass. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess I'll just go up. Yeah, because you can just like stumble into Ikebukuro before, but you'll need the talisman and you just have to go back here. There's nothing at the park. I guess not, no. It was cool to see an Odin at level 85, though. That was pretty neat. Oh, fuck, I can't avoid that. I just wish it was Runo instead. <laughs> wah 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 wah. Wah 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 wah. Wah. <laughs> what general direction is Ikebukuro from here? Uh, north. Oh shit, we're going the wrong way. Oh man. My demons are a bit different. Is in, like, <laughs> Every time he says west. that. Such a good I line. A bit different. Yeah, meme meme is very important. Yeah, you know uh Adachi ate cabbage once? <laughs> <laughs> it's really funny, right? Yeah. It's a very important part of his character. Although, I guess in his case, it's the best of both worlds, because he's actually the antagonist, and, and he likes cabbage. We have to make sure the antagonist is an unlikable character, right? <laughs> yeah. All right, that's over. Fuck the movie. Yeah. Didn't care for him too much. Resist um, dark. Yeah, I think you can. You'll. You think so? Most Megami. Well, like you're not going to fuse a Megami with a Megami, but most light demons will not have resist dark for a bit. No, we already have Sukukaj on another demon anyway. You remember how popular Napea became? Because she was a very early demon. <laughs> this didn't work out too well there. She became beloved by the community. 
I think you do, you, okay. Remember when you were crossing? You, you have to go right again. Hold on, let me talk to this, uh, this old piece of shit. <laughs> hey, it's Odin. Gorgeous woman. This guy's got to jerk off one more time before <laughs> <Yeah>. he dies. <laughs> oh, I gotta blast my load one more time. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Up, up, up. Take a turn at the right. You have to cross the poison swamp again. Oh, uh, shit. Nope. Keeping the poison swamp. There, you have to take that on the ground, I believe. Fuck. I don't need your quest, dude. I just want to... Oh, okay. Great. <laughs> yeah, lifestone. I personally don't think they're going to be used the four stuff again. Uh... Up, up, up. The... The location. Nope. To your left. Wait, like back here? Up. Yep. Ah. Oh, that's right, this fucking place. The Dolly redesign stuff, like Medusa and all that, I don't, uh... I don't know. Dude, like, dude needs to... Um, redesign some of, like, the ST1 demons. Like, give them a polish. That would be really awesome if he did that. Yeah. Let's get a... The ones that... The ones that are solid, yet kind of bland, just because they're old. Yeah, I know what you mean. Oh uh, man, we're... Oh, right into the enemy. I pity you. What level are these guys? 25, 26... Too high. Yeah, he's weak to that. I recently saw a Japanese fan who was obsessed with Tamlin. I was like, why? Wait, why, why do that? I I don't know, maybe he just likes the color palette better, that's just it's bizarre. I like green better than white. <laughs> yeah. With purple highlights. Seems arbitrary. Uh, yeah, just let me rush these guys. Yeah, I really want to see the 12 generals from SMT2 again. Oh, that would rule. All they need is different heads. It's one body with 12 heads. Yeah. It's so easy to fucking... I guess you could change the weapons or whatever, too. Alright, you have to go... Ugh. Yeah. Up here-ish. And all with the, the wind. Do I have? Yeah. I would have thought they would have reused Minotaur in SMT4A just because, like, he's an important demon to Aquila and, like, you're literally that guy in the story. Yeah, it's so bizarre that you didn't get, like, Minotaur instead of Medusa. You could have just swapped them out and it would have worked. Yeah. The difference is that Minotaur does not have breasts. <laughs> yeah, so. I guess so. Good, though. If you willed it. Yeah. So, another breakthrough here. No. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, like, I sense you, you have a similar aura, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, they really didn't bank on the whole Nanashi being Akira thing at all in 4A. It's kind of weird. He gave him those stupid eyebrows, but he didn't, he didn't go all the way. It almost feels like the scenario was like an alternate unused scenario from 4. Yeah. It was already written, didn't predict anything. Um. Just had placeholder holder roles for the demons that they ended up eventually using in the story. Alright, I think this is a good place to stop in front of this, this 
wall of anti-patriotism. Right yeah. Oh, oh, I didn't know. It. All right, well, we'll talk to her. I wouldn't if I were you. Past here is a domain beyond the reach of ordinary hunters. I assume you're here to claim Shi Wang Mu's head and make a fortune off it. Just not the voice I imagined. But leave no, I don't. Th I, was I was thinking like way deeper. I, this is another voice like I don't remember hearing at all. Yeah. Gaia. Even we don't know what to do about this barrier. It's definitely out of your league. If only we had the Jirei Talon. <laughs> if only. <laughs> well, there it is. It's foreign demon spell. You still have it, don't you? Should we try it? No. Wise move. Take my advice and go. Yeah, fuck you. A waste of a good design. I think it's a power that this the Spartan Demon subplot is not talked about more. It really should be. This is like way worse than almost anything else in the series as far as being violently xenophobic. Alright, let's save. <laughs> uh, who won the who won the Super Bowl? Uh, I I stopped caring like three hours ago, but I think the Buccaneers were ahead by a lot. Ah, shit. It's another Tom Brady uh, ring. Great. God damn him. At least he won it on a different team. Yeah, I guess so. But in Megaton Man X wasn't the Cosmic Egg very different until very late in development. Uh, I don't remember from Megaton Maniacs, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't there's know just that. there's alternate concept art. Uh oh yeah. Uh, something that hasn't been translated to my knowledge is uh, all the environment concept art from 4A with its uh, associated commentary. Oh, I forgot those even had commentaries with them. Mm -hmm. yeah. They didn't have like nearly as much environmental art as the first game, though, right? No, I mean well, we're reusing so much. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, it's a good place to stop. Uh, What's up, generic guy? In. All right, thanks, dude. <laughs> What's subtext? That's a myth in itself. Oh man, yeah, games don't have a uh, subtext. It's just regular text. Games, games are not made by people. They just appear. And... <laughs> The they emerge. The people that make them are not projected upon their work. No, not at all. They they emerge directly from the game hole, just covered in Mountain Dew. I'll never forget the amount of people that tried to do like Thermian arguments on me about the stuff I criticized. Oh God, that's right. That's amazing. <laughs> Shit is exhausting. Ugh. I don't get it quite as much though. Da, 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 da. I have everything on layers here, so it's just Enoch has risen above all of this shit. <laughs> he has ascended to the top. <laughs> yeah. I wish still got the gummies. <laughs> Can you find all the gummies? He still got Splinter here. Let me let me get rid of him. He's not memorable enough. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. Oh, <laughs> this is really bad. <laughs> Bikini armor is part of their warrior culture. Fuck, you see quiet right, so absorbs sunlight or something. That's why she has to dress like yeah. a... Like that. <laughs> You'd be ashamed of your words and deeds. <laughs> I wonder if anyone actually was ashamed of their words and dudes when they found out. It's like a uh, deep feeling I, I of shame. Think, I, don't, I don't think anybody was. <laughs> Can't imagine. Maybe at least one guy. Such a bad explanation. <laughs> it's really bad. <laughs> Maybe like one guy who just... Who like worships Kojima but kind of broke away with him <laughs> on that design. <laughs> 
There probably was at least someone who was like, yeah, that's that's it. Yeah, that makes sense. Look at all these whiners. <laughs> Look at all these SJWs. <laughs> Hideo Kojima. Fucking... Yeah, honestly, like, that was the time. That was the environment. So, there's probably more people that were, like, into that than we were talking about. Yeah. That would stand to reason. I don't need to roll up this controller. Next week... Uh, let me check if Rise of the Argonauts is still on sale. I actually haven't bought it yet. That oh, wasn't. So... It's this fucked up site. That's apparently legitimate, but seems like it couldn't possibly. Oh, they got it for $2.03 at Game Billet Belay. <laughs> Game buffet <.com. laughs> yeah, That would be a fucking great name for a, a site that just like resells Steam keys. <laughs> Filet O Game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm willing to. to... XXX. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's, a, it's a fucking X video sub site. <laughs> yeah, I'm willing to chip in the $2 to play this. Again, we should really play a Bible Buffet for the NES. Is that actually what it's called? Yeah, Bible Buffet. Holy shit. Oh. Have you ever seen the box art? Oh my god. What the f- It's one of my favorite things. Oh, this is so great because not even- Not even like a single element of this box art communicates the uh, the biblical nature of this- yep. This buffet. It has all the anthropomorphized food that- like I crave. <laughs> it's just a secular buffet. A mascot lover. Yeah. yeah. What the hell? So what are you? It's it's just like a like a Veggie Tales style thing. Terrible like Pac-Man game. Yeah. So weird. Like like in between stages, there's Bible verses. Oh, okay. Well, that that checks out. <laughs> Like, I think that, like, you have to answer the questions, multiple choice questions correctly about them. Oh, Something. shit, it's like a quiz game. We'll have to pool our Bible knowledge together to overcome it. Angels actually look like people with wings. Uh, swords that got compressed into uh, a forge and thrown into a dumpster. <laughs> Jesus. Or, or sea, like tokusatsu guys. Yeah. They look like, uh... Yeah, they late 80s Kamen Rider. <laughs> they look that's, like Rita Repulsa. That's what the evangelist had in mind. It's funny, like... Part of my family has always been, like... Crazy religious. Yeah. Like, all the stereotypes, but... They never bought the kids those the Bible games. It's interesting. I guess it takes like a certain level of being bought into this ridiculous shit to actually want that for your kids too. Though I don't know, maybe Maybe they had one of the Um like the Moses game. Maybe Moses. Oh, that was a long time ago. Did they ever make a game based on the, the chick tracks, or...? No, that would be, that, oh, be great. No way, Jack Chick. Fucking low the video games, probably. probably video games, then. Yeah. Probably would enjoy that too much. Just try and, like, make a... a cohesive worldview out of all the chick tracks. Like, I'm sure there would be contradictions at certain points. Yeah, definitely. Consolidate and compromise and all. Did Jack Chick actually, like, draw all of that shit the whole time? Or did he have other artists working with him? Mm, I don't know. I th um, <laughs> For a second I thought I actually had a Persona 2 track playing, but I forgot it's just a... Gymnopedy, number one. <laughs> I bet it's like a Jim Davis situation where, like... He got people to copy his style eventually, and... Because the art, the, just... the quality of the art just varies so drastically. 
Sometimes it has that wiki how quality. <laughs> I just like his bafflements and things like that. They're really good. They're very lovingly rendered. Uh oh. This was the... The secret of Halloween. It was the devil all along. Mm. Oh wait, I can't... What a shocker. Yeah, my cousin once told my grandmother that she was going to go to hell because she had Halloween decorations. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Keep in mind, he was like four years old when he said that. That is a tremendous escalation. Wow. Yeah. Oh, man. Going straight to 100 there. You're next. <laughs> ha ha. Uh, that police officer is definitely saying a slur, too. <laughs> <laughs> like, die, you... Chunky... <laughs> you can't say it. Chunky melon <laughs> bastard. Yeah. <laughs> forty minutes later, I don't, yeah. I don't know what happened before that, but uh, it took forty yeah, minutes. The, the sheriff, the sheriff definitely said, "Tis the devil himself." <laughs> <laughs> Tis the devil himself. <laughs> Holy shit! Just, he was running away in a panic. Just in a complete like Alabama accent. Damn. It's a good devil, though. Yeah. Alright, let me re remove this... This legendary track... To... Tracked. <clears throat> Alright, next time... Yeah, I hate- I hate- I hate using the Zeeds as Enoch. Like, that's terrible. Like, that shit is- Yeah, why did they do that? Just name it something else. You see, and then, like... And you see people quote that now, because... Like... Oh, man. Uh, here... Here's the Fate Grand Order version of Enoch. Here's the SMT version of Enoch. It's like, well, that doesn't really look like anything. Wait, seriously? What a stupid comparison. I don't know if that one specifically, but <laughs> I've seen a lot more Fate and SMT uh, comparisons lately. I thought that had like gone out of vogue in 2016, but maybe it's making a comeback. Mm -hmm. You could have only hoped. Yeah, Enoch with his angelic pompadour. <laughs> and titties. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Well, I guess we're done. Yeah, I think that's a good place to call it. Alright, thanks y'all for coming out. Uh, sorry you missed the Super Bowl for that. And, uh... Yeah, Missed all the action. <laughs> yeah, you couldn't see Tom Brady's swan song. Jeez. Um. It's always next year. Always next year for his like shins to explode. <laughs> <laughs> for a demon to come out of the uh, the field and just like suck his soul. His yeah. Mouth. <laughs> I had a joke about uh about how that like hologram of Kim Kardashian's dad was actually a force ghost, but <laughs> I, don't, <laughs> I don't remember how I was going to integrate it. So do with, do with that what you will. Bruce Jenner went to the Carl Jung world <laughs> and learned the secrets. Oh, fuck. I gotta see what that's called. I gotta check that episode out. It's... You'll never find it with that description. It's, uh... Yoda... It's the end of season six of the Clone Wars. Gotcha. So look that up. Yeah, I will. All right, I'm gonna do that, and then I should probably close the stream before I do that. All right, thanks for coming out, y'all. Take yeah. care. I can, f I can feel the left side of my body again. Oh, great. fuck, sweet. All right, see ya. <laughs>